Oh well. It's uh, finally setting. Not super warm yet. Let's get warm in a little bit. I have these uh, sunnies on that I got at Forever 21. This is the one item they do not spend a lot of money on because I've used them and break them. So we got these. Uh, I like them. They're kind of a uh, very dark, not kind of dark, they're very dark, so they really good on a very sunny day. I like to get these kind of glasses at the beach. They're kind of a knockoff of the, I don't know, the Coley glasses, you know, kind of a knockoff of, I don't know. Anyway, my Starbucks as usual. So we are here at uh, Sobro. Soul Brew, Soul Brew, another coffee place. So I'll, I'll probably get a decaf this time. Hopefully they have decaf. Let's get to that point in the day where I can't have caffeine and I'll be up till the cows come home. I did have my, I finished this. I just know I had my little uh, cranky fit this morning when they didn't give me what I asked for. So hopefully it'll go a little better at this place. So we're gonna head in there uh, now. Just got out of Sobro. I mean, had banana bread and coffee, as you saw. It's really tasty. And um, what are we doing now? We're gonna go um, to going over to um, the um, that plant. <laughs> oh yeah, we're gonna go. There's a florist place right across the street. We're gonna pop in there. And there's like mm -hmm. a is there a shopping area around here? Or? There's um. Main we're gonna street shoot too. And, uh, Stony Brook. Is what? Main Street. In oh, Stony Brook. we might go to Main Street and Stony Brook. We're pretty far out on uh, Long Island. And uh, we're gonna shoot somewhere. We're gonna find a cool place to shoot because I'm wearing this uh, Ann Taylor jacket that I got. Uh, pre loved. I wanna do a whole haul on that at some point. But this is a great jacket. I got it for, I think it was six bucks. It was 12 and they were having 50% off day. So it ended up being like, uh, I think, 650 or something like that. Something crazy. So, you know, it's kind of like that uh, Liz Bill Marant uh, knockoff. But um, six bucks works for me. Looks good. So we're gonna try and shoot that today. But first, we're gonna be heading over to that. You probably can't see it there, but we're gonna head over to the uh, the plant store, or what do you call those? Not really a florist, but I forget what you call those things. Uh, those outdoor shopping plant places. <laughs> 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 but that's Thank where we're, name, that's where we're going. <laughs> we're going. Garden center? No, we're having a senior moment. We're having a senior moment here. <laughs> like, what does the name? They, a nursery. They call that's it. Yes, a nursery. Yes. They call a nursery. So we're going over to the nursery. Um, maybe I'll buy bladed Mother's Day gift for my mom. Well, they already got her, like, got her a gift certificate to get her nails done, but you know, maybe a cool plant would be nice too. So, here we go. We're gonna drive across the street. <laughs> so, I'm thinking of getting this plant here. I don't think I want to get this. I think it'll look nice on the steps. And I'll just change the, I can put it in like another um, different planter. Maybe I should get a planter for that too. Don't you want a party? Sitting in the crowd feeling heartbeat. Don't you want a party? Don't you want a party? So that was my friend Lori. I've known Lori for 20 years now, more than 20 years. I'm so happy for her. She had this show and she was interviewed by the Chamber of Commerce here. So I think it's gonna be on their YouTube channel and I'm not sure, but she sold a lot of her stuff. I mean, her stuff, as you can see, is just brilliant. She's so prolific. I had no idea if she had this much <laughs> stuff. So if you're ever uh, uh, out on Long Island in St. James, come to, is it the Brick? The Brick. Uh, the brick and um, it's the uh, studio. It's a like a pottery studio, mainly a pottery studio, and this is their gallery and everything's for sale. And they also have classes, as you saw. So, yeah, you should definitely uh, come on down. Do you hear the sound of the bells? Uh, I love that sound. Wind chimes, not really bells, but we uh, are now in the little town center, Stony Brook. 
And as you saw, my friend was interviewed by the Chamber of Commerce, so very well, and I bought myself a mug. I'll show you that in a little bit. And now we're gonna step out to a little shopping area here. I'm gonna go to a store called Madison's Niche. So I'm excited about that. Some cute things there in the window. I don't need to start my summer spring shopping. Mm -mm. <laughs> <laughs> like I ever really stop. <laughs> it's like it's not like I ever actually stop shopping. Yeah. Well, I have to. I'm gonna have to. It's like, ridiculous. I'm gonna have to stop shopping at some point. Heading in now because you guys heard the uh, the wind chimes. It's so peaceful. I need to get some wind chimes. They're just so incredibly peaceful. Hanging by the window. Zone out, listening to the wind chimes. I like. I know. Peaceful by my house. I have like a, um, behind me is a big field, and then it's like a farm. And then it's summer, you know how it was not humidity there. Yeah, I know. The the air there is so dry. It's so nice. Paper, a book with the dogs and the wind chimes. I know. There's something about it. It just totally puts you like in like a total zen state. Yeah, the wind chimes. There we go. To lose my mind, I'm going crazy Lately I've been feeling every day's the same So I'm just gonna close my eyes and pretend that I'm not here Cause I just wanna dance, I just wanna dance Don't you wanna party? Sitting in the crowd, feeling your heartbeat Everybody's carefree, everybody's carefree Don't you wanna party? Sitting in the crowd, feeling your heartbeat Don't you wanna party? I'm thinking of trying this on. 75% off, so I'm gonna take, take a stab at this. I don't think this is doing it for me. I think I'm gonna say no to this. Job because my hair has gotten pretty thin in the last uh, 
on now, like two decades. When I was in my teens, my hair was like really, really tall and not so much anymore, which is kind of making me really a bit nervous. I actually just started taking biotin and I'm looking into some things that would help with uh, making your hair more full. You know, there's so much about that. Some people say, you know, nothing helps, sure, okay, I guess, which you have to do all the time. Um, my stepbrother, the doctor, swears by taking um, bruise yeast. I, I don't know about that. I, I think that make you um, losing more if you do it early enough, but he even said himself it doesn't make it go back. Um, so lately he said with the B vitamins that are in grains or have all been removed. Uh, the certain B vitamins that are in grains as opposed to like meat and eggs, but anyway. So I'll keep posted on my journey. Anyway, I think I'm gonna be uh, clearing up right now, stopping it now. We'll see you in the next time in the city. Bye. So Elle and I just got out of Housing Works and I did really well. Super good. I got 100 bucks. And I got uh, a theory jacket and fine pants. It looked like a suit. And it looked like a suit when I had it on together. Yes. It literally looked like a suit. A summer, a little summer dress. I think it might even be satin. I'm not sure. Blue satin. And a great coach to get bag. Which kind of looks like that Fendi bag. Very low trendy. Man, yeah. Very logo man area. It's a little beat up, but it was 12 bucks. So I'm not going to complain for 12 bucks. Here's. So now we're heading back to your place. Any place else do you want to go? Uh, I think going back up would be good. Okay, so we're going to head back to Elf and uh, I might do a quick haul, show you guys what I got, and then we're going to shoot, and then we're going to have dinner and cocktails. And Elf does not want to be in my yeah, no, vlog. She's over there drinking oh a glass of wine. <laughs> yes. Cheers. So I'm going to show you what I got. We just got at uh, Housing Works. They're having a 40% off sale. I, was, I spent 100 bucks, like I said, and I got a lot of great things. So, without further ado, here we go. I got this, wait for it, Coach Baguette Bag, yeah. but $12. It's kind of beat up, if you look closely, I can't lie, it's a little beat up, but from a distance, you'll never know, and I think it's super on trend with Logo Mania and the Baguette Bag trend. Like this, so I'm excited to style this. I think I did, did good. 12 bucks. Can't go wrong. Right? Yeah. Then I got this navy, I think it might be part satin, blue, little ruffle dress, which so fit cute. really well. It says it's a size 8, but I think it's more like a size 0. I mean, it's like so small. I don't think if you actually were an 8, you'd get into this thing. It's like super no. small. It was actually a little, was little bit tight. So. Yeah, nice and light, thin. I like this navy color. It looks good on me. I think the navy looks, uh, the color looks kind of nice on me. So cute. And it'll be really nice. Yeah, it's gonna be really nice for the summer when it's like um, really, really hot. Tomorrow. It needs to be dry cleaned. So, yep. Yeah. Um, yeah. Next, I got this basic black theory blazer. They had my size. I couldn't believe it. Often they're too big. It fits really well. The sleeves are a little bit, a uh, little bit short, but not too bad. I can roll them up, but it actually doesn't look too bad with them out. It fits really well. You know, I have that other jacket I got, uh, the maze jacket in Paris, but that's a tuxedo. It's kind of short. This is, uh, it's not long, but it's not, it's not short. It's a like mid, mid-size classic. So I'm just really excited. Looks stunning you can on see her. Here. Theory, like so. Looks brand new. Right? Yeah. It barely looks like it's been worn. It doesn't so look like it's been worn at all. At all. Finally, I got a pair of <coughs> semi wide leg trousers that I've been looking for. I find it really hard to find these kind of pants like this. You know, a lot of the uh, dress trousers or like work style trousers are kind of, uh, they're, they're fitted. They're more straight, kind of fitted. I was looking for a wider cut and I found these and they fit great. Um, they're not too big, not too small, and Klein. So, and actually with the jacket, it kind of looks like a suit. Like I had it on together in the dressing room and it looked like a suit. Like you wouldn't even know that they didn't go together. So yeah, I think it did pretty good. It did great. You know, it's like Memorial Day sale, pre-loved and not harming the environment and it's housing work. So it's also a good cause because all the proceeds go to help people with AIDS and, and people that are homebound and the homeless. So yeah. So now we're waiting for our food. We ordered uh, I guess, it, well, it's not Thai food, it's more like, it's Asian, I guess, it's I think Asian. it's, is it yeah. Chinese? I think it's fusion. But or fusion, yeah. Chinese fusion, something like that. I don't know. And we're going to go on the roof. Um, I'll bring you guys up to the roof. Maybe we'll have a mukbang. You, want, you, you don't want a mukbang? <laughs> She's like, what? A what? 
what the hell is a mukbang? <laughs> yeah, no, I have no it idea. It sounds really dirty, right? It's Actually, true. eating a meal, it's like eating food, having a meal, uh, and conversating um, online, like, you know, on YouTube, or like making a video yourself, and enjoying a meal, and conversating. Kind of weird, right? But it's, it's something about that's engaging. That's like surprisingly yes, engaging. It's much more engaging. Like I was surprised. I didn't think I'm like what? I didn't think I'd like that. But then when I actually watch the mukbangs, they're like, they're kind of fun. I kind of like them. We are on L's roof. I'm just give you guys a little bit of panoramic uh, view of how it looks here. It is stunning. Uh, such a great place to be. Uh, I, I can't believe it. And we're the only ones here. It's Memorial Day weekend, so I think a lot of people went out of town. And uh, it's not super hot, so I guess no one's up here, but we are. We have it to ourselves. We're gonna shoot a little bit, and uh, then we're gonna have dinner. And I'm really excited to get started to do this. And I just finished shooting. She did an excellent job. She shot me with my uh, wide-angle lens. And uh, these shots turned out really great. I'm excited to uh, post them. You might see one of them on Instagram. And we're about to uh, dig in here. We're gonna have uh, Chinese food. I got curry chicken, and I'm not sure what Elle got, but we're gonna be chowing down pretty soon. Elle and I, we just finished shooting, and she did a great job, as I said. I'm gonna post those pictures, so I'm gonna show you here what I'm wearing. I have this Zara jacket. It's kind of like I said before, like a jersey knit. I really love the way it fits. I've had it for about five years, I think, so. This great Givenchy shirt that I got when I went shopping with my little Parisian niece. You went pre love shopping. This is Maison. And then whatever it says over here. And the back said Givenchy. 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 Yes. And then of course, I think you guys have seen this before. My lucky ring. I went to Fashion Week and this ring from Italy. Uh, H&M jeans. Just, you know, they're pretty high-waisted, which I like. Stressed. And then these great shoes from and other stories. I love these shoes. Um, not quite as comfortable as I'd like them to be because they're, they're actually a little big. They're a seven. I really need six and a half. Um, but I'm thinking of maybe getting going to a shoemaker and getting a strap put on. So I think uh, it might help. I don't know. But so we are going to uh, finally eat, have some wine. I cannot convince Elle to mukbang with me. So so much fun. <laughs> great subject. Myself. So another day, another vlog. It's a really nice day. It's a little cooler than I would like. But it's gonna warm up a bit later, go maybe into the 70s. Right now it's probably like 58, 60. Again, I'm meeting my friend Lori, and we're gonna shoot. So I'm wearing here a little bit. This is a top that I got when I was doing pre-love shopping with my Parisian niece, which you saw in the video already. And these wide leg jeans. Uh, we'll get a better look at that. I feel as usual. Uh, I don't know much else to say right now. It's beginning of summer, it's great. It's actually D Day, which is more of a holiday uh, in Europe than it is here. Uh, we had our Memorial Day weekend. For those of you that follow my blog, you know how I feel about that. Um, yes, there was a sale. I went to Housing Works, um, got some stuff, but I didn't do it on actual Memorial Day itself. I believe that Memorial Day should be a day for uh, remembrance. Not a day of uh, picnics and barbecues and shopping and selfies and all that. So on those days, I, I don't do anything like that on Memorial Day. Memorial Day itself, I just stay home. So anyway, that's how I feel. I'm not sure what we're going to do today. I have no plan. I didn't really uh, have time to think of anything. I've been doing a major uh, cleaning and spin cleaning at home and rearranging and doing that all day long, so it me out. So I didn't really uh, plan anything today. So hopefully my friend will have an idea. Um, I'd be going to a cute town. It's so nice out today. So I'll take advantage of that. So I don't know. I want to say next to see me. I don't know where I'll be. So see you. So we decided what we were going to do today. We ended up in Northport. Um, I've, probably, I've done a video on Northport before, but it's a good day for that. So we're gonna stroll around a little bit, um, maybe shoot uh, now, or maybe wait till a little bit later, as we can find a nice area with uh, shade, but they have a nice uh, waterfront, so we'll probably head up over there in a bit. Just kind of just shop around and enjoy this uh, nice day. So you'll come along with, hopefully see a little bit of the town here. And so we're about to step in. All these empty faces talking about problems, I don't care 
here this kind of trench boiler dress or the suit dress I think I'm definitely gonna get in this can't wait to style it yep this is definitely a go so I just got out of a little uh, cute thrift store which I didn't get the name of it I'll have to go back over there and film it and get the name of it Helga's and it's a consignment shop and I got a great you saw in the dress room I got this great uh, trench uh, dress kind of like that boiler suit mode, which is you know super on trend right now. Getting into the nest, um, this great little uh, home shop. Let's see what they have. Not that I can really afford to buy anything, but hey. this great chest of drawers which I can put my TV on top of and then all this storage is, is a whopping $140 I'm kind of in shock let's see here bloody hell it's not focusing trust me it's just $140 going home with me today well not today actually I have to arrange to get it picked up or delivered but I'm getting it <laughs> so as you can see that I got that great um, Drawer. I guess kind of, I guess we call it a bureau or drawer, but it's a perfect height. It's a perfect height for me to put my TV on, and then I have all that storage beneath. So now the challenge is going to be uh, getting it home, I to get it home, and then getting it uh, up the stairs. It's going to be real fun. But I mean, it was $140. I don't know where else I'd find something like that at, at that price. I mean, even at IKEA. I'd be so we just finished shooting. Uh, I had my uh, head to toe pre love look. It's kind of a boho kind of look there. I can show a little bit later when I pop out. Uh, we're going to get some food now. And so that was, it was, didn't go too bad. I found a block that wasn't too crowded because you know, always get a little kind of embarrassed when I'm kind of shooting in front of lots of people. So there wasn't too many people around on this one block, so it was kind of cool. So most of the pictures turned out pretty good. Super nice out, uh, not super warm, but uh, pretty nice and super hungry. So I'm gonna get some grub. We are in the town of what's the name of the town again? Port Jefferson. Port Jefferson. I keep getting confused with Northport. We're in Port Jeff. Got these cool glasses here. You see that I'm sans rings. I left them in the bathroom at Wild by Nature. We have to go back and get them. Luckily, they had them. Somebody, Good Samaritan, turned them in, so I didn't lose them. Like I knew I was going to lose them. I took them off, and I said, remember to put your rings back on. Remember to put your rings back on. And, of course, I didn't. I walked out of the bathroom without them like I always do. So... But well, luckily they have them, so we're gonna go back. But not right now, it's too nice out. We're gonna go down by the water. Uh, the name of the shop, cute little shop here in uh, Port Jeff. These were 12 bucks, I think they're really fun. At the waterfront, you saw a little bit here of the waterfront. Like here at Port Jeff, and then there's a park. There's a dog park here too, and there's somebody taking their little kid out on the water over there. So cute! 
Ah, nice place to just kind of sit and chill. It's pretty hot, but uh, a little cool here down by the water, which is why we came down here. Kind of just chill for a while, get to get rid of some of the heat. Kind of relax on the day that I've had thus far, just losing everything, which has really been great. But I'm gonna try and calm my ass down now. Here in this lovely waterfront area. That was so cool, it was huge. And I wasn't filming that, I already turned my camera off, you guys could have seen the deer. It was very cool, if you all could have seen that. So, we just finished shooting. It's 6,000 degrees out, or just basically just very, <laughs> very humid. And it was very hard to shoot because it was so bloody humid. So, we're heading now back to Wild My Nature, where I left my rings in the bathroom. Uh, they had them, so I'm um, happy about that. I'm gonna pick them up. And then I'm gonna go to a town called Pavilion, get some food. Hopefully, uh, it's gonna cool off. I'm like the end of my growth with this, this bloody heat. There because I got my rings back. We had to go to uh, back to Wildlife Nature, which was heading back west. So we weren't going to double back and go back to Port Jeff. So we went to Babylon instead. And I think we're going to have tacos. I could definitely take some tacos today. Oh, look, cute little alley over there. And just for like the weekend. Still kind of hard. your pictures in? Huh? In froze? Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. We shot there once. It was like freezing so cold. Today it's boiling. Had a life of a blogger, shooting in the cold, shooting in the heat, shooting in high wind. All these empty faces talking about problems, I don't care. I can't wait till sundown because my body's aching. I just want to dance, I just want to dance. Don't you want to party? Standing in the crowd, feeling heartbeat. Everybody's carefree, everybody's carefree. Don't you want to party? Hot as you know what. Super hot. It's going to be 99 today. So we're heading to the beach. It's the only place you can really go. You have to go to the shoreline or a mall. And we're going to sit super close to the water. We're the roller. You may have follow my blog and my YouTube channel. You may have seen my Long Beach video from last summer. So that's where I'm going. I go there quite a bit. I love Long Beach. It's a little bit of Cali and the Big Apple. I, I am just, this is like unreal, like unreal heat. It was mind blowingly hot. I'm so glad to get down to the water. I got my hair with these braids again, twisty braids. That way, it's like a full braid. I think you really do braids too well. So, I feel as usual. Let's go my Starbucks. White shade that I got. Um, you saw earlier. You know, it's in uh, Port Jeff. Yeah, Port Jeff. So this is like my mid-level vlog. Late spring to mid-summer. Um, I'll do like now second half of the summer. But um, we won't be this half for the rest of the summer. So anyway, I'm gonna check out now, and I'll see you all uh, on the beach. Well, I made it here at the beach. My friend Angela. Let's talk to someone on the phone. I don't know. I have a brother here. Getting quite to the shoreline, so we get the breeze. I'm gonna pop it into the water in a bit. Um, I'm not gonna worry about the uh, flesh eating virus in the water, right? Oh, uh -huh. they said. But I think that might just be in Florida, not probably not here. So we're gonna pop it there soon. Right. This bathing suit I got here. It's like, see it. I got this on Amazon. It was like five bucks. I mean, no, fifteen dollars. I'm sorry, not not five. What am I saying? I know. Ooh. I was gonna say, you're busy doing that. Little balls there. Little teeny tassels. I'm going to show you a little bit more later when we send up uh, my oh, friend. Uh, no. I'll show you a little bit more here. Uh, this one is probably, you know, 15 bucks. I admit it's probably fast fashion, but I do do a little fast fashion there? in the summer months. Are they there? Um, a, little, a little more than definitely in the winter. But I'm going to take a dip. Take a dip soon and you guys come along. All these empty faces talking about problems I don't care. I can't wait till sundown because my body's aching. I just wanna dance, I just wanna dance. Don't you wanna party? Standing in the crowd, feeling heartbeat. Everybody's carefree, everybody's carefree. Don't you wanna party? 
Don't you wanna party? Standing in the crowd, feeling your heartbeat. Don't you wanna party?